Reel number two. Yeah, listen to this. Reel number one. He thinks, right, because he's got a few thousand subscribers, right? He thinks, right, because he's got a few thousand subscribers. That makes him a better wild camper than me. No, I'll give you a little tip, right? 3,900 subscribers. Yeah. Another 4,000 left us. So I would have had about 8,000 or something now. Yeah. That's, that's how bad it is. But it doesn't mean a shit to me. I get maybe 10 subscribers every couple of days, but there's five leaves. So. See, it's all about subscribers for him. It's about wild camp for me. Because I am. Shit. I tell you what, he's full of <laughs> shit, mate. I tell you. He's just he proved it by what he said there. I am the real number one because it's about where I'm coming, what I'm doing. Yeah? On a regular basis and keeping a diary of it. That's how you become the number one wild camper. He's got a few thousand subscribers. So what? Start making him a great wild camper. My, my ass. <laughs> <laughs> that tent, it's got no right to be here. Sierra Designs. There's my old friend back, the Crinkleet. I had to throw my old Voyager out, finally give it up. But, uh, so I had to have the Voyager back. Just, uh, take them all, same rope with an old friend. A few changes on it, a bit lighter. Can't see it being strong like, but. Me for summer. So, quarter past six, uh, on grey stones, and with the number two, um, it's been over four weeks since I've been out. So, I've been doing a lot of overtime, I've been working over, not used to it. It's been a quiet week this week, so. I've got out. Last weekend I could have got out but I was laid up with my back and it was gales and I just didn't fancy it so I've waited for the new tent, I should have said my new old tent, the Voyager, so that's what I'll be going out with this summer. All my camps lately, they've just been like, they turn up at a camp and it'll be lighting. It's just been a mare, man. So, uh, yeah. So, uh, hopefully, I get a clear sky tonight. It's just the wind and everything, it's been terrible. I'm, I'm running the overtime. I just, this is me time now. It's time for me. So, Solway Firth, Scotland. Boot. Amazing sunset, number two tent, number one tent. It's got to be the Isle of Man, hasn't it? I don't know if my camera will pick that up. He's saying that could be Highland over there because across the it's across the sea over there. So I don't know. I don't know. Right, I'm going to put my camera on. Actually, it says nine o'clock there, but the clocks have gone forward, so it's ten o'clock. So it is. It's the twenty. Is it the twenty-fifth today? I think it is. So twenty-fifth of March. Five o'clock. 
last week you know from me phone would have went forward probably is because he's doing it automatically kind of clock on my yeah phone. so his phone says 10. i thought i hadn't had that much sleep mm. is it the 25th or 26th i don't know I don't yeah 26th it's the 26th so yeah it's sunday i know that much <laughs> <laughs> It looks a bit shorter at the back of that. I know it's like there's some, there's some little differences. It used to be a bit longer at the back. I haven't pegged this out either. <laughs> I didn't put an extra seat in this. Yeah, you did. That'll do for me this summer. Yeah, yeah. One of his ear plugs fell out last night. <laughs> 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 so I've tortured him all night, apparently. Where's the handle off your pan anyway? It fell off. <laughs> no, I feel like you never took it off. Keep catching on things now. Mm. I've flattened them, I know the end. Yeah. And it's hammered it into the ground. So it doesn't, it doesn't catch on anything. See, that back thing's done you a favour now. You can take your time and watch me. See how it's done <laughs> properly. <laughs> That's all not to do it. I would not normally to do it. Uh, get this pleasure, would you? <laughs> yeah. This is how you don't do a breakfast. I just, uh, <laughs> if this back gets a bit better, I'll show you later. I'll be having breakfast for tea, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to stay another night because my uh, my back's gone and went down like a sack of spuds. So luckily, I've got a day off tomorrow. And I'll just get up at the crack of dawn and be away. So I'm set up for the. It's. As if, I mean, if I could walk, I could walk to to another hill, but I'm not. So he's this. He's bailing out on me. <laughs> Ling fell, sail fell with Binsey behind it, Northwait, Broom fell with Skidor behind it, Lord Seed, Helvan Range, Winletter, Grisdale. Guys, they'll buy. Time for a cup of tea, I think. The brew. <laughs> so it's seven o'clock. Um, I took some brew from about three quarters of an hour ago, so I finally feel as though I'm going to have to cook through some of the wheat. It's not quite without Dave. <laughs>
worth spending another night. I'm getting a bit short of water. If there was only just a bit of water here, it'd be perfect. But I'll be up early and gone. Check that sky out. It's amazing. That's what it's about. Outdoor wild camp. Outdoor, not indoor. Wild camp. Outdoor wild camp. Had a really good night inside the Voyager. There's a veil of Lawton. Never mind throwing eggs around, like the number two. Our cook man. Vine right in tomatoes. Hello, my name's Jonathan Bigbottom. I'm the local warden. Have you got a permit to camp here? No, you haven't, have you? Right, I'm giving you 15 minutes to pack your tent away. If you're not packed by then, I'm going to spank the arse off you. Now get packing! There's the sun. So things should start to warm up now. So I'm going to get out the tent and pack. It's 20 past 7.
right so so the next time probably about two or three weeks before I get out with the extra shifts and all that probably on another fell so right